Okay, it's February 28th, 2010. It has been exactly one week since I've gotten out of jail. Um, my lawyers tell me I shouldn't be doing this, but... Um, anyway, about two months ago, I... I really thought that I could be like one of the Navi and I could ride an animal. The problem is that the only animals that I live with are my cats. And although I've tried to, to ride them, um, I can't give them my full weight because they're much smaller than me. So, um, with the help of a few tools, I can't say which ones because uh, that will definitely get me in a lot of more trouble than I'm already in, I, uh, I broke into a zoo. Not, not broke in, but I stayed a little longer than I had paid for. Um, and I decided that I was gonna get to know the animals there and see whichever ones I could hope to ride because I really need to be one with the animals. I mean, when I saw those scenes in Avatar, I just, I knew that something was missing in my life and I wasn't sure how to obtain it because it's certainly not coming with any of the human relationships. But I knew that once I connected with another species in that way, my life would be complete. So, I walked around, you know, kind of sussed the animals out, you know, trying to figure out which one I could really speak to. And I was trying to also make sure that I was doing it the right way, the movie. You know, it's, you know, the animals that are scared of you, it's not going to work out. The ones that are kind of bored by you, you know that they're not the ones. But the ones that want to kill you, those are the ones you need to ride. Um... So, I was kind of a little chicken, because I, 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 I knew it would be a little easy to go into the lion pen or the tigers, or even to go near the bears, um, especially since I don't have the training that the Navi people do, and I'm not as strong as them. But, I wanted to give it a try. So, I decided to go for animals that are not typically scary, but can be scary. So, I decided to go for the ostrich. Um, so, I, uh, I, I managed to get in the, the pen, the ostrich pen, and um, at first it just kind of looked at me, not really being able to make up its mind whether I was there to feed it or who, who the hell I was to break into its pen. And then as I approached it, um, this is kind of embarrassing, it, uh, it kind of ran at me. It, it started charging. And I, I, I didn't know what to do. So I... Um, I kind of started running away from it, but um, I didn't really actually plan how to get out of the pen. I had only planned how to get in. Um, so I, I took this rope that I had brought and I, I kind of tried to, tried to distract the ostrich and I started throwing the rope and hitting things with it. Um, you know, like the ostrich food and the pen and just, I, I, I kind of started screaming, um, trying to get attention, but anyway, um, the ostrich chased me and I ran and I screamed and I tried to hide and at some point, I don't know how this happened, but I... 
I don't know, I guess adrenaline just gets to you, but I somehow managed to, I mean, this is kind of all a blur because I was so, ugh, I was so afraid. I managed to jump on the ostrich. I, I have no idea how. Um, and I don't know how long I stayed on, but the next thing I know is that I was in restraints in a hospital. And uh, I had marks. I, I had some marks all over my body. And I think there are still some feathers kind of just stuck there that I don't think I'm going to be able to get out. Um, you know, but I don't understand why that, I mean, I did everything that the movie asked of me, you know, I, I waited to find that animal that I'd have that connection with, and I, okay, I didn't ride it immediately, but, but, but I know I did ride it, I mean, I remember, I remember briefly what that was like, so, what now? I mean, how am I supposed to pay for my lawyers? Um, anyway, my court date is, uh, in two weeks. Um, I've been banned from any zoo for life, which is really painful for me because I really love animals. Um, and now I don't know how I'm ever gonna have that connection. <sighs> um, yeah, this is getting really emotional for me. Um, anyway, I, uh, I'm hoping I remember more so at least that experience can be with me. Because if not, then what was the point? Signing off.